So behind me, just the remnants of what's happened here, a missile strike, an Israeli missile strike against a civilian area. Uh, it is a, a Muslim neighborhood, but uh, this is the second strike that's happened in a week. There was another one that was in a residential area as well, a house just a couple of blocks from here. This one was much more destructive. We're hearing uh, reports from several people that it was four or five bangs. Uh, I had been uh, just about a block away, and it sounded like two very loud explosions to me. But, uh, emergency workers were on the scene fairly quickly. There's also uh, definitely civilian casualties. I saw them coming out, uh, women and babies covered in dust. Um, the destruction is immense. It's almost a huge city block. I'm going to pan around here just a little bit so you can see it. But it is intense. Lots of smoke, lots of fire. A lot of young men were here using pillows and, and blankets and trying to put out the flames until the fire department came out. There were people here uh, trying to find other victims. And there's a lot of anger here, a lot of seething anger. I talked to certain people uh, that were on the streets when we came in right after the missile strike said they hated America. They didn't even mention Israel, but they hated America. And you hear people right now cheering, uh, doing a Hezbollah cheer. This happens every time there's a missile strike. Young men in the streets chanting support for Hezbollah, shaking their fists. There's a lot of cameras there recording them right now. But again, this has become a very dangerous area. This is a place where initially people were coming to take refuge, the city of fire. But now, uh, this has been hit by missile strikes. There's a lot of uh, concern whether this can be a safe area at all for people that are coming from uh, villages that are further south. People are using this as a platform to uh, chant messages of support for Hezbollah. Uh, firefighters are still trying to, uh, to put out some of the flames using uh, hoses. And uh, after that's done, I'm sure they'll begin uh, trying to look for some bodies. But right now, again, to recap, a missile strike that happened about 30 minutes ago in the heart of downtown Tyre. Uh, it took out what looks like a full six block. Emergency support services on the scene fairly quickly. Casualties pulled out of the building. And again, it's yet to be determined why this particular area was struck. This is the second time that the, this particular neighborhood has been struck within five days.